The Boulder County, Colorado coroner confirmed former Heisman Trophy winner Rashan Salam died of a self-inflicted gunshot wound to the head. Salam was found dead on December 5th in Boulder's Eben G. Fine Park, not far from his home in Superior, Colorado. One of the University of Colorado's most decorated football players, Salam rushed for 2,055 yards and scored 24 touchdowns his junior year at the school. He was drafted by the Bears in 1995, but his career was over by 1999. Dave Plotty, Associate Athletic Director at University of Colorado, remembers Salam. Never knew he had these kind of demons inside him, that he was, he was struggling the way he was. Never let on, and you know, people are prideful and they do that, but you know, I'm sad because I was as close to him as anybody and you know, loved the guy to death. And, Wish I could have noticed or done something for him or wish he had called me. In a 2012 Chicago Tribune profile, Salam attributed his career decline to having no discipline and to his pervasive marijuana use and partying. But at least one family member said recently that Salam suffered from the crippling degenerative brain disease, chronic traumatic encephalopathy, which currently can only be diagnosed post-mortem. Scientists have linked CTE to repetitive head trauma that is an inherent part of playing violent contact sports like football. Following Salam's death, his brother Jabali Alaji told USA Today Sports that he believed Salam displayed all the symptoms of CTE while Salam was still alive.